All right, guys, welcome back to the Porsche Shop Yard. This is Ryan, and today's video is part two on my nine, uh, 2001 Ford F-150. And uh, we've done a little bit of work to it today, as you can tell. If you look closely, that wheel and tire versus that wheel and tire, they look very different. And why is that? Well, we went over there to my trailer in Jefferson and took both the back tires off my white Expedition. And because these tires are brand new, I just had them put on back in February. And so we took both the back tires off and swapped them, put two front ones off this one that were worn on here. See, they both the back tires off the white truck are now on here. And, I mean, they're, they're perfect. They fit perfectly fine, and everything's good to go. Again, we still got to fix the driver's window. I want to show you guys something. My cousin yesterday, these headlights were really, really foggy and clouded over due to age and, you know, just, um, just, uh, fogged up. He said, you got a can of off, let me use it. So I did. This is what happened. I wish I had a before and after, but I don't. But it went from real cloudy looking to looking almost brand new. And he did Frankie, as you'll see. If you see him, he is right over there. Let's see, he's right over there. You see him, but um, but yeah, we put these tires on today. Um, you see back here, we got the spare tire for this truck and the other tire, which is actually the front one. That one's got to go back under the truck. Got my floor jack and my lug wrench. Part for the window when it rains. <coughs> anyway, guys. Um, we're going to look at some things today. Um, got my keys here. Yes, I do. Um, <coughs> I don't even think I showed you under the hood in the last video. I'm going to do that today. But, um, you see it cleaned up nice. Cleaned up real nice. Put that down just for one second. Turn on the switch, I hope it comes up. Dear past, present, and future. Let's see. It ain't gonna come up, but this thing's got 303,600 and... 30 point something miles, almost 630 point something miles. 303,000. Ladies and gentlemen, that's not even broken in yet. This thing's not even barely broken in yet. It ain't broken in at all. I've seen these trucks with two and a half million miles on them. And they're still running strong. Original motor and transmission. Original rear end. You can't say that about a modern GM or an older GM. Damn, things go out all the time. Motor, transmission, rear ends. I'll go out all the time. Um, let's see. Um, what else? We slip my. Um, let me slide my keys back on my side. But this thing ain't even broken yet. As you see, this is loose. No big deal. Pop back on. We'll go over here. Look at the, um, go to the hood real fast. Ooh, it's hot, 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 hot. 4.6 Triton 2 valve V8 motor. Smooth as silk and runs like a top. Don't leak, don't smoke, don't burn no oil. Runs like an absolute champ. Maybe I did show y'all this in the last video, I don't remember. 303,000 miles on this motor. Still runs and shifts like a dream. Not even barely broken in. You can see batteries probably going to need replacing soon. Got to fill the washer fluid up. Um, I do need to check the, the fuses inside. I'm having some problems with my turn signals and my brake lights. I think there's a short somewhere or a bad fuse or something. I gotta check on that. 
but um but anyway um yeah guys this thing ain't it don't leak a bit it don't I mean it runs like an absolute whoa damn that's nasty look at that look at that that damn oil is disgusting mmm well I know why this thing ain't been took out on the highway enough it's been sitting it's been sitting about a month month and a half it's been sitting it ain't been drove oh boy that does not look good we need to take it on the highway good out on the interstate for a good hour two hours and clean it out clean that system out it gets real milky now again as i said this is a brand new motor so it ain't got no major problems it don't run hot don't leak don't smoke none of that it runs like a top it's just that from where it's been sitting got a little condensation in it and it turns that color but it ain't no big deal i've seen that before in frankie over there I didn't drive him, I used to not drive him around town a lot, and he, his oil looked back like that. But, um, yeah, I got these tires on, gotta get two for the back. The two, the two back ones, uh, the original wheels are going back on, I just gotta get tires for those other wheels. I just put these off my other truck for not, not just to, until we get the tagging all switched over tomorrow or next day. You can see these tires are in pretty decent shape but um as you if you look down here look here it still has the muffler that just the tailpipe itself is rusted off no big deal i do need to uh let's see i think it's up there you can see it right up there is the fuel filter i do need to change it soon too that's one of my plans I check the bulbs and the brake lights and the turn signals. I don't know. There's a short somewhere, I think. Maybe just a bad fuse. But uh, but yeah, guys, this thing runs like a dream. Uh, nothing wrong with it. it. Runs like an absolute top. I am gonna have the hood painted repainted back blue because it's all faded but I want to put my Ford tag off my other F-150 on here put it on here or I might have one made that says old blue on it ain't quite decided yet I need to refill the washer fluid reservoir Four point six, just like white lightning's got in it. Ooh, what in the world? Oh, twenty years old, and the hydraulic shocks for the hood are still up. Scotty Kilmer say, "Oh, they just don't hold up over time. Them shocks wear out. Yeah, they might wear out, but it's cheap to replace them. Even the hood light still works. Look at that. Even the hood light still works." Again, you got your side steps, no lights like white truck, original fuel cap. I want to take it to Auto Bell after we get it road legal and uh, have them detail it good. Got a, something bumped it right there. No big deal, it's a work truck. Oh, you got your tail, your bed. Everything works. Got my jack and all like I showed you before. And we'll go back in the back again. Let me hit the unlock button. Show you in the back. Um Back in the back. 
as you'll see. Rub it clean. I got some fill stabilizer I just put in the tank day before yesterday. Throw that away. But kind of back here, it's a very comfortable truck. It is a very comfortable truck. You got cup holders here. You can see. Um, carpet's in excellent shape. My shop towels, you got your slide back glass, which works excellently. Um, it ain't on this side, but you'll see over here. Right there, you got your uh, cigarette lighter for your phone charger bullet. And um, just a very comfortable truck. I wouldn't think twice about jumping in this thing now and driving to California. Wouldn't think twice about it. Um, but that's it for today's video, guys. Uh, remember to hit that like button and thumbs up button and go subscribe to my channel and not miss another one of my videos. This is Ben Ryan on the Ford Shop Yard. Thank you, guys. Bye.